What's going on people, Jada Black here. Back with another video. Shout out to everybody that's tuning in. This video, I'm making this video um, because I want to continue to highlight why men aren't getting married. You got women who always want to ask me, why don't you want to get married, Jay? Why do you speak out against marriage, Jay? Because of things like this. Most of the time, women are filing the divorces because men know that once they sign those those contracts, which is what marriage is, they're going to have to take it as far as they can. You know, because usually when a man marries, that's who he wants to be married to. Plain and simple. But for a lot of women, it's a come up. And for this female, her name is Gwendolyn. Um, is it Gwendolyn Osborne. OK, she was married to Kenny Smith, Kenny the Jet Smith, former uh, NBA player, two time, is it two time champion, Kenny Jet Smith. He now does commentary or coverage on TNT on the NBA show. And they are divorcing. Now, I want y'all to understand something. Before I went and live to record this, I went to Gwendolyn. Uh, <laughs> I went to Gwendolyn's Instagram. I'm just, I'm still looking at the Instagram while I record. <laughs> and I went to her Instagram. I want to say, I want to look and see. Okay, maybe they're breaking up because of the fact that he's cheating on her, or the fact that she's in mom mode, so she's focusing on that. I go to her Instagram and. It's, it's about her, you know, she's putting herself out there, showing off her body like she knows she still has it, which is one of the reasons why I believe she got divorced, because she still believes that she got it. She still believes she can get her a baller. She still believes she can get her a successful brother. And she probably felt like this was the right time to get divorced. Now, here are the particulars of the divorce. This is according to Blast.com. Says Osborne is seeking primary legal and physical custody of the couple's two children, 10-year-old, was it Malloy? And six-year-old London. She also is seeking spousal support. They've been married for 12 years after meeting at a charity event in 2004. The former Houston Rockets star also has two children with his first wife, Dawn Reeves. And Gwendolyn has a child from a previous relationship. So Kenny basically married a single mother. He did what other men were not willing to do. And this woman still divorced him. And what was really interesting is that she is also on The Price is Right. She's been on The Price is Right according to her bio for 12 years. And what's very interesting was that in her bio, she has 12 year Price is Right model. And she is divorcing Kenny after 12 years. Do you think that's a coincidence? Maybe, but I don't think so. And also, Kenny Smith was uh, promoting, I don't know if it was a year ago or two years ago, he was promoting a reality show where he was going to feature his wife and his daughter. I believe, I, I'm, what I'm trying to think is, because I didn't really watch the interview, I just saw that he was going to be on there. I think I saw a little bit of it. I don't know if she was the woman that was with him. Y'all can correct me if I'm wrong because it's been a while. But was she the woman that was with him promoting that show? Because that show was about his adult daughter and his wife. Well, not adult, but she's older than the kids he has now. And they were promoting the show. I thought that he was married to this woman. Again, I don't know. Y'all can let me know in the comments. Because I don't know how his first wife looked. But anyway. And... You can look at her Instagram and tell you that she wants to be more than just a Price is Right model. She wants to be more than Kenny the Jet Smith's wife. She wants to be a celebrity. She wants to be an actress. She wants to do her modeling thing. It wouldn't surprise me at all if in another week or two she's dating again and she has another guy. Because these women never go are not going to leave no relationship that they're comfortable in to just be single. That's not going to happen. Okay. These women like to have sex too. You know, these women want to have a companion and they're not going to leave a situation. 
citing irreconcilable differences, which is, you know, code for I just don't want to be with this guy no more. So I'm going to divorce him. And also what's interesting is that she still has his last name. What have I said about these women keeping these men last name on her Instagram? It says Mrs. Gwen Smith, Gwenny Smith. But you just divorced this guy. You were planning to divorce this guy. Listen, divorces don't happen out the blue. When you when you get divorced, it takes time. It takes preparation. You have to get the paperwork done. You have to speak to the lawyers, get lawyer advice. You have to get everything set up. You have to basically uh, alert the person that you're with that you're divorcing them. Even with all that, you still got this man's last name. And even in her bio, she has her first name, but she doesn't have anything behind it because nobody knows who Gwendolyn Osborne is. That's not a celebrity's name. But being Gwendolyn Smith, wife of Kenny Smith, now that's different. If you want to be a celebrity, go ahead and be one. Stop using these men's names. Stop using who they are to get you far because obviously... He didn't get her far enough to the point to where now she wants to file for divorce. You got two children with this man. So you mean to tell me that what you trying to have a career, you're going to be a single mom too? What sense does that make? You might as well have stayed in a marriage. You got all these women that so desperately want to get married, but as soon as the going gets tough, they leave. They leave. To be a single mother, another statistic. I'm not saying Kenny Smith is, um, you know, he, he hasn't had, he hasn't done anything to warn a divorce, but did she put it out there that he cheated on her, that he was abusive to her? No. So I'm going to go off of the facts and the facts of what I see is a female that's still trying to find herself in her identity. You know, she even got a few posts up trying to show how pro-black she is. She got a post up with Colin Kaepernick and she got another post praising the Black Panther movie. Y'all know how some of these people do. She still thinks she got it. All you got to do is look at her Instagram. She still thinks that she can get her a baller. She probably talking to a couple of them now <laughs> on the low low. It wasn't surprising at all that she's some dude side chick. You know, some dudes jump off. Because y'all know how these guys go. When when a dude realizes that you're single, one of these rappers or athletes, they're going to hit those DMs. And she's going to be choosing heavy. But because she's been in a relationship for so long, and now, you know, their social media is bigger than it was when she first got with Kenny, she has her pick. And I'm pretty sure she's going to pick the wrong <laughs> She's going to pick the wrong one. Like most of these chicks do. They get out of these long-term relationships. And they think because they still have a nice body. And they're attractive. They're still going to get the same caliber of dude that they just left. You know, Kenny's making good money on TV. He's making that good TNT money. I think Kenny's doing all right. I don't. Now, she's looking for spousal support, of course. Now, I, there's no numbers out there yet. But we're probably going to know what the numbers are very soon. But we know she's looking for a bag. At least a couple. She's looking for a couple bags. You know, you're leaving this situation with Kenny because you think there's better out there. Women make this same mistake, and I, I, I will never understand it. Women, you got to understand when you have children by another man, you're getting older. What option do you really think you're going to have? You chose to get married, you chose to commit to this guy, have his children, and you want to leave now. You want to leave now because you you you're now on Instagram and social media and you think that you're going to get you a younger guy with plenty of money. Maybe you do get that. Maybe you get that. But you need to understand, okay? These guys ain't looking to marry nobody. Okay? Because they're seeing exactly what your ex is going through. This is what this will be Kenny's second divorce. Okay? And she has three children all together, two with him and one previous, okay? No man is going to want to step into that situation and take up the reins, especially not no famous dude, and we all know she wants a famous guy. Once these women get a taste of being with a guy who's famous, it never goes away. This is why you see these women dating men who are in entertainment. They never veer outside of that because they're obsessed with that. They're addicted to it. And the thing is, is that 
in this situation, it just proves why men, women need to stop asking me why I don't want to get married. Because I'm going to, con the more, let me tell you something, the more females ask me why I don't want to get married, the more videos about divorce I'm going to make. Because you're getting divorced for stupid reasons. You know, couples used to be together for 20, 30, 40, 50 years. Now people are getting divorced because they think they still got it. They still, they, they still don't believe they've hit the wall. So they want to go out there and be single. They want to go casually date. And what she probably is thinking that, well, if it doesn't work out, I can always go back to Kenny. That's if Kenny ain't moved on. And that's what the mindset of a lot of women, they, they will go out there and they will be single and date casually. And then what ends up happening is they get older and they get older. The looks don't look the same. The kids are getting older and they get lonelier and lonelier. And what they realize is that all that casual dating, all that one night stands and going from dude to dude has gotten them nothing. It really hasn't. So maybe I'm wrong. Maybe she'll bounce back. Maybe she just wants to be single, but I don't know. But y'all let me know in the comment section below and uh, let me know your thoughts.